So depending on the size of the order and what it is you order will very much vary how the equipment will arrive. Um, there's three main ways we would ship a, an order. Uh, the first being like a smaller order, like a bar um, or an accessory. That would be sent in a box, um, which should be packaged and sent via air freight um, using one of our many couriers. Um, the second way uh, would be like on a pallet. So it could be a single machine or a couple of smaller machines uh, that group together on either a single or a double pallet. So for example, something like this, uh, as a freestanding dipping station, would be sent on a single pallet. Um, and then the logistics company, couriers, will be able to just pump truck that off the lorry to the floor so it's delivered to your door. Um, and then all you have to do is just carry that from the door where the courier will leave it um, into your gym or facility. If it's a double pallet, so a larger pallet, maybe a animal leg press, for example, it will be sent on quite a big double pallet. Um, so we do recommend having people there to help unload. Obviously, it's gym equipment. It is quite big, heavy. Um, so we recommend having you know, two or three people that can, can lift and help out uh, the courier. Um, the third way we would send things uh, would be like a larger order. Um, so that could be a full gym or you know, a home studio. Uh, this would be sent maybe on a, on a lorry or a container if it's going overseas. Um, and this would re require the customer to get maybe a forklift to unload. Uh, lorries do get sent with tail lifts, um, so you can have a tail lift delivery. Um, but if it's a container, you will need to get a forklift uh, to be able to unload. Um, all of these options can be fully installed. Um, so if you are worried about the delivery side of things, we can install absolutely anything to anywhere as well. Anywhere in the world we can install. Um, just let us know, let us know where you are, what it is you want, um, and we can work out installation prices.